It is finally time for season two's finals of week one of the ESL MKX Pro League. Done by Xbox, Brian. And this is also the last time you and I will commentate together. At least until the finals. At least oh, the yeah. Finals. I'll pop I'll pop in on the finals maybe. Just pap in. You know, Just pop in. Come through. I we'll think we you. maybe have a trailer to shoot. I don't know. Uh, maybe. I haven't decided if we're going to have you in the trailer yet. But I will <laughs> oh, let you know. Uh, well, I'm making well, those decisions know. now, sir. So incredible night so far. The first, oh, first three matches were definitely so great. Quick. Oh yeah. First man. couple matches were definitely quick. Couple three quick. O's. However, the semis and the were nuts. Oof. And then, and then, uh, Tweety Dab was good. Even Tweety though it was Dab a was good. I I agree. Son of Fox Wild Cowboy was crazy. That was a good map. Crazy. It was crazy, man. Yeah, it was good. It was good. Uh, good. But yeah. now we head into the finals, the first finals for season two, and yeah, it's absolutely. gonna be Dab versus the cowboy himself yeah so i mean two like west coast ish guys west coast ish you could say yeah both of which are actually in the northern area yeah California, so if you shout out to norcal man doing work great stuff love to see it i'm gonna put my money if i had any which i don't on dab <laughs> well dab's your boy dab's all of our boys dude you can't have <laughs> what what nothing <laughs> mm, okay so <laughs> Oh, that was quick. That, that was the finals quick. right now, man. We're about to make season two dreams happen. Dreams. If, okay, so for some of you that may have missed season one, Dab was on the cusp of hitting that final dream where he was going to qualify for the finals. Well, he technically Unfortunately, he technically qualified. Well, he tied. Yeah. Which, eh. But he didn't make it. He was so close. He was. He was on the rim. Like, it was like. You shot the J, it just kind of rolled around the rim, and, and it just off. fell off. So Going in, so we now got here Tanya. we go. Of course, Tanya. He's trying to make it happen. Can Dab win the first week against Necromancer? And then, oh, maybe this is, I think this is an adjustment that Cowboy has made specifically for Tanya, because we normally don't really see him pull out Necro. Very rarely. In fact, to be honest, like really not a lot of people use Necro mm -hmm. at all in tournaments. I love that the little the flick, flick though, man. Mm -hmm. The flick just is so epic. Like, like, Get off. <laughs> Look at that. And it's, it's working. It is working so well. Hellsparks flick. This is very difficult. Oh, for Tani to get in, and this looks like he's yep, he's gonna close out the first round. Uh, wow. What Cowboy's doing is he's just very effectively shutting down the air options for Tani, and that is huge. That's Which, that's so cool, man. So what I like is he stuck to his character, and he just learned a different variation. Every variation. He, yeah, that that he felt gave him a better matchup in this particular matchup. That's awesome. Love that. And it's working out so far. Yeah. Finally, Dab does get in though. This is dangerous. Man, Cowboy's looking and sharp Cowboy just tonight. pokes his way out. Of course. And so Dab needs to figure this out. I mean, also, he probably hasn't played too many really good Necromancers. No, I I don't even think I've ever played against the Necromancer. Like online. In all my 10 hours of online play, I don't think I've ever played a Necromancer on Bond's level. But here oh, we go. Dab is starting to find his way in. He's got him in the corner, but now a shoulder Cowboy charge, with a shoulder. Meter burn, but meter burn of his own now. Dab comes swinging. And a break. Oh, this is close. It is. Oh, oh, oh my oh. goodness. Oh, oh, the drill! drill. And that's for the chip. Yup. Boom. One round apiece. <laughs> oh, Christopher Walker. Boom. <laughs> Is that, that was walking? That was, that oh. was, it, was a, it was a horrible attempt at It walking. was perfect. I don't judge you. Alright. Alright. So now Goes Cowboy in. hits him with the overhead. The little T-Rex arms. Corner. I want to see what I kind of pressure... Oh, I was going to say, I want to see what kind of pressure Cowboy has in the corner with Necro, but now it's all back to Dab in the corner. There's really not a lot that you can do against this. Holding the pressure, now confirming, and he's going to keep him standing. Oh, man. Oh, he read it this time, but doesn't get anything off it. Dab avoiding. I love the adjustment Dab yeah. has made here. Great read by Dab. And, I mean, this could take him game one. This should. This, in fact, will. That is it. Game one. Dab the taking bag. the first game for all owners of beautiful hair out there absolutely that's why it uses tanya i know uh, it, hurt. it was a stretch it was a stretch yeah well okay that was great adaptation from dab uh, yes cowboy obviously has chosen this variation just for this specific matchup he came into the game with a plan he had an idea right yeah dab got you know lost the first round and then totally turned it around yep and well, that's that's what Dab does. He tends both of these players actually adapt really well and really quickly. Absolutely. We are definitely gonna see some counter adaptation, if you will, from Mr. Cowboy.
Mr. Cowboy. Mr. <laughs> Everyone is Mr. today. It is. I'm a respectful gentleman. <laughs> Round that's one. that's adorable. Alright, moving into the second game here. Oh. And starting off with an overhead, getting that first hit. And he's sticking, <laughs> he's sticking with Necro, and that's yeah. actually somewhat big to have whiffing completely a bar of meter, but now that I think about it, it's really not that big because I forgot how much meter she builds on block. Yeah, and just during her pressure, like, he is extremely strong character. Oh, Cowboy is the using, flicks. he's using the flicks and, and most of his Necromancer-esque specials to keep oh, him at full screen, but then he's using Hell Sparks to kind of oh, cover that mid-range. He's dealing with the pressure here. Cowboy he's trying to get out. Still stuck in pressure. Nice. He neutral ducks under the returning hit of the Tonfa. I believe it's a Tonfa. I could be incorrect on that. Please don't quote me. Oh, that's going to be a punish. Yeah, that was a great block. He's seen it one too many times. He's like, not again. Right. Cowboy in a really good position right now. And he's oh, going to meet a burn late, but he doesn't confirm. Ooh, you do not want to let Tanya live with any life whatsoever because the second she gets in and she puts that pressure it's on Chip it's City, man. very difficult to get her off of you. Grab oh, oh, good read. Good read, but now again, Dab is in and this is where it gets dangerous. He's going to burn the meter, but he drops the combo. Puts himself in the corner. Oh, whoa. He's all that over was, the place. That was risky. Yeah, it was. For both players. Uh, Dab, fortunate though, didn't take too much damage because of it. Oh, right, catch the meter burns it. This is huge. Oh, the overhead. I think he's three for three on those overheads against Dab. Again, in fact, all night. So big life lead here. Oh, I was going to say he's just uh, oh, happy zoning her out. Wait a he second. just goes in. Oh, that's that's going to be it. Be it yeah. Cowboy tying it up 1-1. One, one. I said Necromancer-esque. Yeah. We know what I was going for there, B-Rai. I don't think anyone has ever said think. that in the history of the world. <laughs> <laughs> Excuse me, variation specific necromancer moves. So that but yeah. that's what he was doing. Cowboy okay. was using his necromancer specific moves to keep him using him at full screen, mm -hmm. and then once Dab was coming in, that's when he started letting the hell sparks fly. And it was working. He was keeping Dab out and for the most part that game he was able to just you know get out of the pressure, up close pressure from Tanya. <laughs> up close to Tanya. I knew it was coming. You knew it was coming. I was gonna say it before you did, but Brian, you, you always know. I do. This is a big game here. <laughs> yes, it one, is. 1-1. One. Like I said, counter adaptation. Counter adaptation. And don't about. don't be surprised if Dab does a little adapting himself. Download the download? Download the download. Can you do that? He's uploading, I guess. Up okay. <laughs> okay. All right, here we go. Burns the meter. Yeah. Oh, Ooh, and he's going to get thanks. the combo. Switch sides twice. And Swagging smart. It up. Very smart from Cowboy. He had to get... The momentum, he, had, he just had to get Dab off of him, but here we go again, Dab burning the meter, he's gonna build more. And it looks like he's gonna take out this first round, yep, and yep. very, very intelligent from Cowboy to not block, preventing not Dab to build games. any more meter. Very smart. Round two. He, he knew he was dead, yeah. that round was over. And he has a pretty good meter advantage going into this round, so. And here it comes, meter burn hell sparks. All right, what, is he gonna go for another overhead? He is, but a backdash <laughs> from Dab. Smart stuff by Dad. Mm -hmm. Oh, stuffs sure. it out early. Oh, a little injustice right there. Little gen generator action. Oh, the teleport. And, and it works. That's going to be a punish. Oh, oh wait. He... Whoa. That, that had was to so be weird. an error. That had to be an input error from Dab. Yeah, he dropped the combo and then didn't cancel the teleport in time. I love the pressure from Dab. Just little pokes <laughs> here and there, mixing it up with grabs. But now he's full screen again. Gets, Gets right back in. I wish... Pushing him to the corner, teleports out just to see what Cowboy would do. Nice box from Dab, but he gets opened up anyways from the meter burn. This is so close. This round is so close. Playing oh, it smart. He... Oh no! That was. That's gonna be it. That was really good for Cowboy. Made him burn the meter. Tying it up, going to round number three. Here in the set, it is tied one-one. Oh, again, going for the pressure, but yeah. smart. From Cowboy to realize that jumps right over, gets a grab. Cowboy on no meter though, so it's gonna be hard for him to do a lot of damage. Tanya almost up on two bars already. Yeah, and we've we've seen a lot of jump ins from from Cowboy that we don't normally see, but he's honestly landed a lot of them. I think he's just trying to throw off the pressure game yep. from Dab, and it's working. 
Good stuff from Cowboy, but again, neutral the duck. ducking. The projectile on the way back, and it's been working out, getting it down forward, but still, once again, stuck in pressure. He's going to do it again. A backdash from Dab, but Cowboy's still catching him. Oh, he gets What a teleport. What a great jump in, yeah. I, what oh, an air to it. That was the read. And Cowboy is now up 2-1 to one against Dab. So, hmm, I wonder if he's just going to stick with Tony the whole time. He does have a handful of other characters he can go with. Obviously, Cowboy's been doing the math on this on this yes. matchup, man. If I were to tell Dab right now a character to choose, Liu I Kang. would tell him to go... Actually, Liu Kang in this matchup isn't terrible. <laughs> um, I would tell him to go Jax, wrestler Jax. Devora is not a character that I hmm. knew that he plays, so this is very interesting to see, but I think... I don't think he's going to pick Devora. I don't either. He's playing the mind games right now. The online character select mind games. Channeling my inner dab. <laughs> <laughs> he's definitely taking some time to think here. Mm -hmm. And he it looks like he's going to stick to his that? guns. I respect that. I mean, they were really close. They were. I mean... But again, I think I think Wrestler Jax is, is a tool that, that Dab does definitely have that he just doesn't utilize as much as he possibly could. I like seeing him stick to his guns. Mm -hmm. I really don't like seeing the uh, you know the, last the switch around. Yeah, and that's good. I agree yeah. that it's good that he is trying to stick to his guns. But I feel like in this specific matchup, he would do uh, very well. But it doesn't matter. He's going right into it. And of course, this is game point for Cowboy. We yep. are week one champion after defeating Sonic Fox, which is. Pretty just, huge. Just a big deal. And Dab has all the control right now. He's got Cowboy in the corner going with the pressure. Goes for the low. And now he's mixing in the throws. Very, very good stuff. Oh, the empty jump. I love those. Very, very good. Yes. <laughs> you, got you think you dab? You ain't dab. That's really the only reason I want him to play Jax. <laughs> all right, catching him on the end of that Rekka. I'm just teleporting out and they get flick. flicked. And this is gonna, oh, I was going to say, this is going to start for Cowboy. I thought he was going to stay full screen, but he's going in, mixing up his pressure. I like that. Keeping Dab on the gas, but it doesn't matter because, again, another successful jump in for Cowboy. And now he has the corner pressure. This is right where he wants to be. Oh, she just armors through. He should have known. He should have known. Throws him into the corner. Oh, oh, he loses. He he knew that he was going to neutral duck, and he tried to meet him in the air, but unfortunately, Cowboy was just faster, and that is going to chip him out. Yo. Yo. Ooh. Wow, Cowboy. Turn point right now. What is Dab going to do? Okay. Oh, that's huge. He needed that. Okay. Kind of resets the situation here with the throw. I like it. Oh, and gets oh, health marked All in. the way up. Nice little, now these combos aren't necessarily doing that much damage from Cowboy, but he's just getting a lot of stray hits. He's getting a lot of zoning with the Necromancer skills. Uh, down two. The health sparks, everything is, oh, that was is working out. That was a good jump in by, uh, well timed by Dab. Great nice. use of arm by Armors Cowboy. through. It is so even right now. Cowboy with a slight life lead. Dab's just trying to do anything he can to get that pressure. Wow, Cowboy oh. really knows this matchup inside and out. Knows all the gaps, all the holes. Now Dab is starting to mix it up. That is unsafe. He's just taking some risk here. He He's is like, taking yeah. some risk, and it's working out. And here we go, oh Armour. Oh, my gosh. The no way. The comeback. Oh, this might not. He burns the... Oh, he backdashes the meter burn, but that's, that's not going to matter. Cowboy. Cowboy. Oh. Going for the fatal. And he's going to get the fatality. I love it. Impressive. So as I predicted, Cowboy did win. Taking out Dab. Of course. You're never wrong. In a, in a very, very exciting set. It was a great set. That was a really good set. But we definitely did see towards the, the second, the third game, mm -hmm. that Cowboy was clearly starting to get the advantage. He knew when to poke out. He knew where the, the gaps in Tanya's pressure was. Mm -hmm. He was armoring correctly. Really great stuff with the projectile. Neutral ducking on the way back so he didn't have to sit there and block stun. Dab trying to get his pressure going, and he was for the most part, but... Cowboy was just one step ahead of him, and he was able to take it, and he is Season 2's first week champion. Yeah, congratulations, Cowboy, you know, from NorCal. We hang out with him every once in a while. Every, Comes every on once yeah, in, a, and in, a, so. in a moon, if yeah, you I'm will. very happy for him. I'm sure he feels great tonight. Uh, 
you know, week week one victory in season two, and of course defeating one, just, one of the greatest players. Let's just look at the bracket that let's, he had to go through. On top of beating Sonic Fox, this. he had to beat Amru, who was, in my opinion, incredibly improved. Oh, uh, he played from out of season his, one. He played out of his mind tonight, man. He and, was awesome. And then he had to go through Dab, who was very consistent throughout the first season, including some offline majors. So yeah, Dab's a great player. So. Cowboy. Cowboy. Critical reaction coming up big again. Three members in top eight. Mm -hmm. One of which Sonic Fox, the other was Biohazard. All three of them played great, as well as congratulations to all the other members that made top eight. It's going to be a crazy season, and yeah. uh, it's going to be. <laughs> and I'll be watching. It's going to be without you, B Rai. <laughs> it will. It will. It, it uh, sincerely has been like an honor and a privilege to be able to stand here. Um, I'm just. Thrilled to be here, and I'm thrilled to continue doing the work, you know, on the other side of the camera. And it's, uh, you know, it was a great season one. And like I said, I'll, I'll probably see you again in season finals. And I mean, I just appreciate all the love that I get yeah, on, you know, absolutely, Twitter man. and everything. It's like, uh, like Chef was saying, it's been, it's been crazy because you were one of the main driving forces for SoCal to even have an NRS scene. Um, yeah. Back when, <laughs> you know, we we weren't kind of back at Wednesday night fights after Evo, and mm -hmm. uh, you know, so I just want to thank you for being. You know, kind of the godfather of our scene down here. It's been really nice having you support us, running your tournaments. I've won a few of those, so thank you for that. You have, yeah. Uh, thank you a couple bucks. <laughs> um, but again, so thank you so much for everything that you've done. Now it's great to see you move up and get this opportunity within ESL. Not that you deserved it, but everything else you've done. <laughs> I knew it was coming, man. I knew it was coming. I knew give you a little boop little on jab. the nose, you know what I'm saying? But again, thank you so much. So Brian Compton is going to be taking a backseat. He's going to be helping more on the production side. But I just want to wish you the best of luck. It's been Thank a you, sir. fabulous, a fabulous time commentating with you. And Agreed. You know, now we have uh, Mr. Wonder Chef, Evan Hashimoto. Yeah, he's going to be great. And he's going to do a great I job. So guy. I'm excited to have him as my uh, co-commentator. And I think season two, if anything, if tonight was an indication of what we're going to have, Sonic Fox losing a little earlier than we're used to yeah. and not winning everything, he's and a crazy obviously going to be back. A nice top eight. Yeah, it was cool. Some returning faces, some new faces. Yeah. Again, I guarantee you we're going to start seeing some Yomi boys in these top Absolutely. eights to start competing yeah. with Pig the CR guys back, online. Like... Pig, hopefully Big D. Again, wish right. you a speedy recovery, man. Absolutely. I know that, that to sucks, Big D. but it's rough, man. Again, so everyone, thank you so very much for joining us. This is going to be Dustin Kane and Brian Compton signing off. We will see you next week. The SLMKX Pro League presented by Xbox.